Hi everyone. Today we're going to do a workout with the squishy ball. This is my squishy ball. I love it, especially to do core work because it's so great for the lower back. A lot of people have low back issues. So I'm going to show you what we're going to do. Go grab your squishy ball and we're going to start by just placing it right there on our lower back and just lean back, get a nice feel. You're not gonna squish that ball. And we're going to take a nice bend and just bend backward over that ball. Feels really, really good opening up the chest. All right, now let's come back forward. Take the ball, put it in. We're gonna extend our hands. We're gonna lean back and then slide the hands up. So you're really using your core to get you up here, sliding it back down. All right, we have 15, here we go. One, reaching, two, I just do this with my hands, three, all right, all of a sudden, four, you're gonna feel that core engage. Five, awesome, six, really work it. Seven, eight, feel that contraction in the core. Nine, I'm feeling it. 10, 11, 12, 13, we're almost there. 14, you got it. 15, whoa, all right, come on up, take a break for a second. How did that feel? Really feeling that core? All right, you're gonna love, love, love this next one. So we're gonna lean back, come up just a little so you, until you feel some tension on the core. We're gonna drop and reach to one side, drop and reach to the other, all right? We have 16 because now we have to be even on each side. So here we go. One, two, three, good job. Four, really reach it. Five, woohoo, I'm feeling it. Six, seven, halfway there. Eight, nine, ten, don't stop, don't stop. Eleven, twelve, woo, thirteen, fourteen, two more. 15, last one here, 16, and bring it on up. Whoa, I felt that, I know you felt it too. All right, so now watch this, we're gonna take the ball and we're gonna place it right underneath our low back and just sit here for a second because this is great to release that lower back, feels really, really good. We're gonna bring our hands down for support and bring our legs up. Again, just whoo, you can see my legs are shaking because now I'm balancing on the ball. Just gonna stay here. This is really great if you're walking around all day and you wanna just keep your legs up. Great way to get the blood flowing and take the pressure off your low back. All right, now we're gonna work some scissors. We're gonna drop one leg down and the other one is gonna push back a little bit. Bring it up and exchange and breathing the whole time. All right, here we go for 16. One, two, three, you're using your core. Four, we don't always have to be doing crunches. Five, six, good. Seven, eight, nine, 10. Are you counting with me? 11, good, 12, 13, ooh, I'm feeling it, 14, 15, last one, 16, really good. All right, now we're gonna take those legs and bend them a little bit to a 90 degree angle. We're gonna drop one down and then drop the other one down. All right, not so bad, here we go. One, two, 
three. Feeling that? Four. Good. Make that mind muscle connection. Five, six, seven, eight. We're going to do 10 here. Nine and 10. And now we're going to drop both legs down just a little bit. One, just to where you feel comfortable. Two, mine is right about there. Whoa. Three, four, we've got 10. Keep it going. Five, you can do anything. Put your mind to it. Six, good. Seven, eight, two more. Nine, last one here. 10, bring it back up. Really, really good. Now we're going to take that ball. Watch this. We're going to put it underneath our knees right here. And we're going to do a nice reverse curl, kind of targeting in that lower ab area that's so hard to get to. So it depends on how, how much you roll up, whatever your comfort level is. So here we go. We're going to roll it up. I'll show you. Just rolling it up. Ready? We've got 15 of these. One, two, that's it, three, four, you're going to feel this immediately, five, six, seven, eight, nine, keep it going, ten, eleven, twelve, 13, couple more, 14, and 15. Wow, that was really, really great. All right, let's take a nice stretch here. We'll bring the other leg up, just open that, give it a nice stretch. And we're gonna finish off, we're gonna flip over to the other side. We're just gonna place our hands on top of the ball, push down, rise up and you're going to feel a nice stretch here in your core. So we worked it. Now let's stretch it. Take a deep inhale, exhale, push up on that ball. Whoa, feels so good. And come on down. Let's do four more of these up and down. Another one here. Three feels good. Four, my hair is all over the place. And last one here, really feel it. Push down to rise up and come on back down. That was great. So that was a nice, short core workout you can do with the squishy ball. It's great to do by itself. Add it to a workout, whatever works. Great job, and I will see you on the next video.